Hey friends, welcome or welcome back to the Teal Pumpkin. I'm so excited about today's video because I'm doing a collaboration with Kayla Friday over at Little Cahaba Junkin. I'm also doing a collaboration with Michelle and Cheryl over at Uniquely Vintage U. We are going to be going antique shopping slash junking. Um, I am doing that on my channel and I'm going to take you around to this really cool antique shop that has lots of junk. It has um, antique glass doorknobs. It has, um, they had corbels. They had like old shutters and old doors. It was a really cool um, antique shop that I had never been to. So I want you guys to please go over and give um, Kayla and Michelle over at Little Cahaba Junkin for Kayla and Michelle and Cheryl over at Uniquely Vintage U. Please tell them I sent you and I hope that you will enjoy their videos. I have no doubt that you will. They are amazing. And Kayla, thank you so, so much from the bottom of my heart for doing this video with me today. I am so thankful. And with that, let's get going on our video. I'm so excited to show you what they have. Let's go. Okay, guys, we're going to start outside. They have so much cool stuff. They even have it outside. They had like mantles, they had shutters, they had old buckets, old desks. This was an old tractor seat. They even had an old Chevy parked out front that was super cool. Um, doors, windows, just really, really cool junk. Okay, now we're inside and they have all of these kitchen items that are so neat. All these copper pots and molds, just so much to look at. I thought this scale was so pretty. It reminds me of something that would have been in my grandmother's home. So anytime I go to the thrift store or antique store and I find old vintage items, it always reminds me of my late grandmother.
Look at all of these salvaged corbels. They are just so neat. All the different kinds and styles. I had been thinking about purchasing some corbels that I found online that were not actual real ones. They were just a reproduction. And now after seeing these and how chippy and just how cool they are, there is no way that I would go and purchase those reproduction ones. The smaller ones were about 45 and they went up in price after that.
there was lots and lots to look at. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this. If there's something that has caught your eye, I would be very interested in hearing a story about it or um, if you liked something. I found a lot of interesting items, um, but I only picked up one. So stay tuned to see which one I purchased. So I'm going to show you what I got today. I only purchased one item. Everything in this antique shop was kind of expensive for my price range. I did purchase this item. It is a copper mold um, and it is a heart and I thought it would be so cute to use for Valentine's Day. I really, really liked it. Um, and then this is what the inside looks like. And it has the little hook thing here that you can hang it on the wall. And I thought it would just be so cute. That is the only item I purchased. And this was $29. I asked them if they would be willing to do a discount, but since it was someone else's booth, they were not able to give me a discount. Sometimes I can get pretty chatty and I don't want to be super chatty, so I'm going to keep this hopefully short and sweet. I want to thank Kayla so much from Little Cahaba Junkin for doing this collaboration with me and with Michelle over at Uniquely Vintage You and her sister Cheryl. We really appreciate you doing that with us. Sweet, sweet Kayla. And um, I guess that's going to do it for the video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give me a thumbs up and please think about subscribing. And I hope that you guys stay safe. I know there's lots of winter weather out there. I hope where you are, you are warm and toasty. And just thank you guys so much. And with that, I'm going to close down the video. I hope that you know that you are very appreciated here at the Teal Pumpkin, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks again, Kayla Friday at Little Cahaba Junkin. Bye. You are the vine, and we are the branches, and I can